South Australian grape growers are turning to a tiny native mammal to act as a secret weapon against insects. They're building small houses to accommodate microbats in the hope they can reduce their use of chemical pesticides. This noisy handful is a microbat named Barbie. She's tiny, weighs less than 15 grams and has an enormous appetite. So we know that they eat insects. They can eat up to half their body weight of insects a night. So they're pretty good at munching down on those insects. And it's that eating power that could see Barbie and other microbats turn into a secret weapon against agricultural pests. In McLaren Vale, south of Adelaide, a dozen wineries have placed these bat roosting boxes alongside their vines. Ecologists use cameras on poles to see where the microbats have chosen to make the boxes home. Adelaide's own Batman, Terry Reardon, is helping with the project. Things that we're really keen on is building uh, what we're calling bat hotels or bat condominiums. So we're now upscaling from these shoe size boxes up to really large uh, structures. Recording devices that pick up the microbats' echolocation have been placed in some wineries. It's really surprising that we, we're seeing and finding the, these bats and seeing them on the recorders because, um, yeah, the people are like, what do you mean we've got bats around? Because you can't hear them. The project is generating interest, with more than 30 wineries attending a microbat workshop last week. The local Natural Resources Management Board, which is running the project, hopes to learn more about the behaviour of the eight microbat species around Adelaide. About one quarter of all the uh, mammal species diversity in Australia are bats. They're as native as kangaroos and koalas, but we don't think of them as being native animals, of course. And with these native predators capable of eating a thousand insects a night, it's hoped the project might reduce the need for chemical pesticides. Megan Dillon, ABC News. McLaren Vale.